Good afternoon. Lawmakers are looking at a bill that put teachers, coaches, and other people in authority who have sex with students behind bars for a lot longer. It comes amid a number of high profile cases that resulted in no jail time. News 13's Alex Goldsmith is live at the Roundhouse with the story. Alex? Kim, this proposal has strong bipartisan support and would ensure that those who are convicted spend at least some time in prison. In 2012, Christy Sanchez Trujillo was only given a year of house arrest and probation for having sex with a 13 year old student. Last year, Patrick Matthews had all of his prison time suspended for having sex with a 16 year old student. Right now, if a teacher has consensual sex with a 13 to 18 year old student, they can only be charged with a fourth degree felony with a max sentence of a year and a half in prison. A proposal carried by Republican Rep Sharon Klausha Shilich would make that a second degree felony with a maximum prison sentence of 15 years and it would also have a required minimum of three years in prison. Trust is being abused. The children's trust is being abused. The parents' trust is being abused. And when that trust is broken, then there's a big concern. The bill also applies to anyone in a position of authority over a 13 to 18 year old, including someone like a coach. Now that proposal has already cleared both committees in the House and could be heard by the full House later on today. Back to you, Kim. Okay, thanks, Alex. Now that bill did clear the House last session, but it did not make it through a Senate committee. We haven't heard of any opposition on the Senate side, but it being a short session, there's a question if it could be lost in the shuffle.